At Rolls-Royce Electrical, we develop propulsion systems for different applications, in different power classes, and for different architectures. In all these electrical power and propulsion systems, the same fundamental technical principles apply. The electrical motor converts electrical power into mechanical power. In the case of an aircraft, to provide thrust using a propeller or a fan. To operate, the electrical motor needs electrical energy, which can come directly from the grid, from an energy storage device like a battery, or a turbo generator or a fuel cell, converting a fuel to electrical energy. Electric motors and generators operate with alternating current, while power distribution and energy storage for efficiency use direct current. Power electronics are integrated into the system to change the current into the form needed and control power flow at each point in the system. The propeller is driven mechanically by engine and motor. All the electrical components of the system are connected by high voltage cables to transfer high power efficiently and low voltage cables for lower power auxiliary systems and to communicate data between the components. As all components contribute to the system weight and volume, an integrated design approach is needed to optimize both the individual components and the overall system. So, in principle, our electrical systems consist of electric machines for conversion between mechanical and electrical energy, power electronics for electrical power state conversion, energy storage devices, and control units to define component performance and response and the system layer, connecting all the components together efficiently and effectively with the required resilience. At Rolls-Royce Electrical, we have organized our expertise along the technology capabilities needed to develop each of these bricks. Additionally, we always have specialists in place for equipment health monitoring and data management to ensure that under all conditions, the operation of the system can be closely monitored, securing reliability and availability. Welcome to the third era of aviation.